Hey there YouTube and today I'll be showing you the basics of a burning laser in powder toy of course. So first thing we'll need to do is grab some white hole and uh, let's place it like this. Now we will take some diamond and uh, put some diamond like this and like this and uh, now we will make something like an iris right here and we will need some clone as well. So we will put clone like this and uh, the thing that we'll need is uh, some uranium and what uranium does is it heats the photons that I will add just a bit later so here we go and this is the uranium fill it up like this now let's add some pressure to it um where is it? there it is so let's add some pressure and uh, you can see that the temperature is rising and that is what we want so let's heat up this lower uranium part heat up this upper uranium part and uh, there we go now what we'll need next is um, photons and uh, photons are right here let's just pause it and uh, add a little bit of photons right here and uh, as you can see we've got something that looks like a laser let's pause it again delete some of these photons so you can see and uh, let's add some metal to it and uh, when we re resume here we go you can see that the metal is heating up and uh, it's burning it can burn through anything well, anything except the diamond and white hole and something else which uh, can't be burnt or melted but uh, this is how it does uh, let's try with I don't know gold titanium maybe let's do it here's titanium and uh, let's put some gold behind it and uh, titanium is a bit hard to melt so it will take some time and you can see that the frames is uh, 6 frames per second so uh, I'm just a bit sorry about that but you will see it and uh, while it's burning or melting should I say I will explain to you what it does so first of all the white hole will push the photons that are generated or should I say cloned by the clone element and uh, it's pushing them through this iris and uh, as you can see now let me just erase this so let's grab some metal and uh, if I take the photons and I like you know emit the photons towards the metal the metal will not melt it will just heat up as you can see it's a bit reddish right here so photons all by themselves cannot melt the metal so that's why we've got the uranium which generates heat under pressure and uh, that heat will transfer to the photons and the photons will melt the metal so that's basically it that's all there is to it that's the basics and uh, in my next video I will show you uh, like an advanced tutorial so I do have some lasers that are more compact and more powerful than this one and uh, that's whoops daisy that's what there is to it so yeah see you in the next video bye bye